using a vendor saves you time. So you have to put a you have to put a value on your time. So if you can sit at your desk for two hours and run a promotion, do a Facebook promotion, run an ad campaign, uh, do an email, you know, you're going to generate more revenue than you're probably going to save running to these places. Mm. So the key is to find, the key is to try to limit, for me, it's trying to limit my, my trips there. And I, I talk to my restaurant suppliers. I'm like, listen, um, this is the same item that Restaurant Depot has. What can you do for me? And if they can come within 10%, of the price of Restaurant Depot, I'm perfectly fine buying it, even 15%, because I know my time is very, very valuable, and for me to spend two, three hours to run to save $30, $40 doesn't make sense. So when I go to Restaurant Depot, I stock up. I take my van, and I totally stock up, and I want to know that I'm saving $400, because I feel my time for three hours is worth $400. But on the same hand, if I'm monitoring my analytics and doing other things, I can probably probably do a promotion that brings in that kind of money. So I really, I don't, I don't, if I do it every other week, that's probably it. Um, so, you know, sometimes the smaller vendors are better. I found, you know, Cisco's a massive. Um, Keith is a big company. See if there's any smaller guys around you, and 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 with lower minimums or more frequency stops. Um, you know, we have a great vendor that delivers to us every day for six days a week for literally a hundred dollar minimum. And you know, so for me. It's saving me. T- I mean, I could, yeah, I could go to Restaurant Depot and save money on romaine lettuce, but it's just, it's, it's not, it's not what I want to be doing because I want to be at my desk, I want to be in my restaurant, I want to be strategizing. So for the time being, keep doing that, but look at it now as this is my time, and what is what is the real value on my time? Because once you start learning all these other techniques, you're going to be like, okay, I'd rather do this than spend two hours or an hour doing yeah. this. So for the time okay. being, keep keep doing what you're doing, but you'll see. You're going to want to prioritize the, or value, put a value on your on your on your time. Right. So, and but that you're definitely going to want to start working with a distributor. Um, I do know restaurants that do 100 percent with Restaurant Depot. I feel Sam's Club doesn't have enough doesn't have enough restaurant quality things or restaurant packaging, bulk sizes of things. Is what I, I got find. You. Is what I find. I got to tell you, Sam's Club's trash bags are great. The cheapest mm-hmm. out there. And if I go buy a Sam's Club, I'll go buy five cases so I got trash bags for six months. Because right. I can't, right. I, 320 bags for 20 bucks, nobody's doing that. So, right. you know, that that's how I prioritize my time now, only if I'm going by and I stock up. Yeah. Hey, Marcus Giuliano here. Uh, so if you like the content that I'm providing in this video, uh, you can get my book, 50 Mistakes That Business Owners Make, for free. Uh, follow the link below in the description of the video. And there's a link to get this book for free. I will ship it to you. Um, You just pay the shipping. I've got the books already here. They're already paid for. 50 mistakes that business owners make. 15 years plus of me documenting uh, my mistakes and how I corrected them and how I mastermind with some of these mistakes and how I learned from others and what I teach my coaching clients. And again, this book is totally free, so take advantage of it uh, while supplies last.